How's it again, Jack Tackers, and welcome back to another video for you guys. Today, I'm going to be talking about five things we want to see in the next Spider-Man movie. So without further ado, let's get into this. Starting off with number five, I think we can all agree that we want to see more personal consequences that Peter has to deal with, and the mid credit scene of Spider-Man Far From Home sets this up perfectly in my opinion. Peter will ultimately be a fugitive in this film, and it should be really interesting to see how this impacts his relationships with Aunt May, MJ, and even Ned. Peter is going to have to toughen up and try and fix the mess he's in. At number four, I have the Chameleon. Now, this is an interesting one, mainly because he was heavily rumored to be in Spider-Man Far From Home, yet we never actually got to see him make an appearance. Though, I don't want to say too much on this matter because I do have a video planned talking about where the Chameleon could be, so let's just say I think it'd be really damn cool if we got to see him in the next movie. Coming in at number three, which is somewhat of an unlikely one, that being the symbiote. I'm not entirely sure if they would want to have another Spider-Man 3 with a symbiote in it, but think about how cool it would be. Now that Peter is pretty much a fugitive, what if the symbiote continues to make Peter do bad things, which makes him an even bigger target? This could add a really interesting element to the story and would honestly just make things more intense. In terms of us seeing Venom in this movie, I guess that could be possible too, but again, I'm not sure Sony really wants to share the rights with Marvel right now. At least not to that character. At number two, I have Daredevil. Yes, now I know some of you may be thinking this is really unlikely to happen, but it actually might not be. Let me explain. They said they can't use the Marvel Netflix characters for at least two years, and when will the next Spider-Man movie most likely come out? Two years from now, or at least that's what happened with Spider-Man Homecoming and Far From Home. So, in the next Spider-Man movie, what if they are able to finally use Daredevil and bring him to the big screen at last? I can see it already. Peter on the run, looking for a place to hide, and then he ends up hiding at Matt's apartment. Like, damn, how great would that be? Now, at number one, I have the conclusion of the trilogy. What do I mean by this? Well, I think this will probably be the last movie of MCU Spider-Man, mainly because we don't know if Sony wants to continue sharing the character with Marvel. This final film could conclude MCU Peter Parker's story, so us fans can be satisfied with it. But let me hear what you guys think. What do you guys want to see in this next movie? Let me know down in the comments. And if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Boop.